Hi everybody, BT here with FXLiveDayTrading.com. Uh, Today is Saturday, it's uh, June 23rd. I wanted to do a video on the Euro USD Forex trading pair that uh, may just help you this week to uh, grasp an understanding of some of the technical aspects of this particular uh, Forex pair. Now, on this chart, unlike a lot of the other charts that I may uh, do videos with, this particular chart I made clean. All right, this is just your basic chart with candlesticks, with Fibonacci, and with our key trading levels that we um, discuss in the trading room. So I wanted to just map these out. Now let's get to the f um, aspect of the fundamentals regarding the uh, Euro USD and then I'll just touch on some of these key uh, levels here on the Euro dollar. Now there's definitely no doubt that uh, many people are tired of the uh, news that's coming out of Europe. I am compelled though to review certain facts that I have made a note of and I wanted to do a, a video here. You have to understand that Europe is currently experiencing severe bank runs. All right. And uh, budgets in virtually every Western country on the planet are out of control. Now, the, this is just facts. Banking system is running excessive leverages and risk, and the cost of servicing the ever-increasing amounts of government debt are rising rapidly and the economies of Europe, Asia and the United States are slowing down or are in full contraction. So just to put it straight um, it's probably best to just stop listening to politicians and central planners who continue to downplay um, the serious fundamental risks not only in the European Union but in the US. So let's just focus on Europe. The fundamental aspects are just staggering and I think it's amazing that the euro dollar even closed above 125.50. Just want to make a note here from a technical standpoint we closed below 126.31 on Friday. Okay. We have our support level 122.89. Okay, that was a recent low reached a few weeks back. And we have 118.89 below that. Okay, so a break of the 122.89 I feel is going to bring us to the uh, 118. And of course, a move above the 126.31 should bring us to this trend line which I think is is going to get respected. So I'm going to make this video short. I hope this uh, basic understanding, just keeping it simple here, not only the fundamentals are in play but I think the technicals are sure to follow very soon now. Obviously we've been on a downtrend um, however, I'm, I'm looking for the 118 um, to be in sight, uh, and I, you know, personally, if you, in my opinion, for what it's worth, I would say by the end of the summer. However, as we know, uh, trading uh, Forex futures stocks, they're not going to do what we want them to do. Or what we hope or think they're going to do, they're going to do what they want to do. So, needless to say, we're going to trade every day based upon our charts, um, and especially when we do the type of trading that we do in our forex training room, we look for certain key levels and we take the train regardless uh, of what we feel. Of course, there's always uh, some allowance for, you know, the gut feeling in trading but at the same time sticking to set rules psychological conditioning and strong money management are um, 
highly important to being successful in trading. If you'd like more information about the Forex training room, we now offer uh, Forex signals as they are taken in the trading room are sent SMS as soon as the trades are taken. So if you're not in the Forex trading room, you can still benefit by having um, these quick simultaneous signals sent to you and it really offers a, a great service on top of the uh, current Forex training room. All right. So everybody have a great one and I'll make another video next week regarding the Euro.